Hi dear friends, welcome back. Every project manager aspires to execute their project very well and dream of succeeding in their projects. Here we present to you some of the essential steps for managing projects. There is much to learn to become a great project manager. You have to juggle time, money, people, equipment and materials. To do it all, some people think that they have to be a miracle worker, but it is not the case. Just take a few steps which has been told here which will help you in managing your projects better. Number one is initiate carefully. When you start your project, unwind it carefully. Define the process by which you are going to manage the project from start to finish. Adopt a project life cycle so that you know what to do and when. Then you take these few steps. Number one, define the project goals, timeline and schedule. Number two, quantify the amount of resource you need. Number three, specify the project goals and deliverables. Number four, decide if you need to outsource a supplier. Number five, recruit a team and set up a project office. Next is plan in depth. Identify the tasks needed to complete the project. Prioritize them and calculate the amount of time that each task consumes. Create a detailed project schedule so you know what you have to do, when and how. Here you take a few of the steps. Number one, identify the number of resources you need. Number two, set a budget and plan your expenditure. Number three, list the deliverables and set the quality targets. Number four, plan your communication so that everyone is informed. Number five, decide how you are going to manage risk, issues and changes. Next is execute swiftly. Execute the plan quickly and efficiently. This is the longest phase in a project and so you need to work smart to complete it in time. Most often, the execution is just about 20% in terms of the value of the project, but it requires 80% of the efforts of the project. Now take a few steps here. Record the time taken by your team in completing the tasks. Number two, frequently check your actual versus planned progress. Number three, if you are starting to fall behind, take action and get help. Number four, resolve risks, issues, changes effectively. Number five, keep your team motivated by rewarding good performance. Next is close and learn. When you have produced all your deliverables and handed over to your customer and sponsor, then you are ready for closure. Do this by releasing the project staff, contract staff, contractors and the equipment. Then close your project office and complete the handing over formalities. Take the time to identify the lessons learned as these will be important for you and your organization in the next projects. Friends, with this, we come to the end of this session. In case you have liked this video, we request you to press the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.